Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you from wherever you are watching from. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, we're extensive. All right, so I noticed in OBS, when you, once you download OBS, OBS does not come with this NDI uh, features. If you want to connect your Easy Worship to it, or if you want to connect your Bible show to it, it doesn't come with the NDI features. You have to download it separately as a plugin. So I'm going to teach you how to download and install this plugin. And don't forget, my name is Joseph Olasukomi, and this is Extensivo. Okay, so um, in my OBS, I actually added this webcam where I am here also. So this is my OBS, and if you want to add the source in OBS, there's always this NDI. This NDI, because I downloaded it actually, that's why it's here. Ordinarily, it's not your NDI source. So how do you connect this NDI source? Okay, I'm going to drop a link in this video, in the description of this video. I want to drop the link to this page, this link actually. So once you enter it, I can just download your OBS from it, the NDI plugin. The moment you enter, go to download. I want to see it and make sure to download for Mac. If I using Mac, make sure to download for Windows. If I using Windows or better still, I can just I since I downloaded it here, um these two instead of you wasting your time, I will help you save this also in a Google Drive. I'm gonna save it in a Google Drive, so I'm going to put the link of the Google Drive also here where you can download it instantly without having to enter the link and download it and the rest. So once you download this, just send it to your system and install it. Okay. So after installing, make sure you install the both of them. But um, the only reason why it will not work is if there's an higher version of OBS coming in. So you're going to need the higher version of the OBS NDI also, that's it. But for now, I'm using OBS 30.1. So you can just download this OBS. I'm going to put this in the link, the both of them. You download the Windows installer for Windows and download the NDI 5 runtime only for Windows though. If you have for, if you have for Mac or for Linux, I'm going to put in the link to this website, to this particular page. I can download this. You can download yours from there. Remember what I said. Um, you no, know, the more the updates the OBS, the more the they update the plugin also for. So this plugin now look at this plugin now requires an OBS version 30.0.0. So if it's not working for you, it means you're using a lower OBS. This is its 4.13 year change on dependency to um OBS 29.1. So the more they update the OBS, the more they update the NDI also. All right. So just make sure um when you download your OBS, when you enter the OBS website. Uh, any OBS, um, any recent updates from the OBS, any recent version. I also want to bring in the recent version here when you, you um, refresh this page. I'm about to see it and I'm about to download it and is it busy? So make sure you download it and once you download it, again, you install both of them. You install as administrator or you can install me. I didn't install as administrator though. So you can just install it ordinarily and I'm going to ask you uh, the questions and once you install it, you will see it in your OBS here. Okay. So if your um if your OBS was open when you install it, you have to cast your OBS and reopen it again before you can actually see the difference. Because you know it was not opened when 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 when, when it was installed. So you have to cancel it and enter it again and then you're going to see the difference over here in the I stream source. Alright, so let me test it and see if it's working. Let's go to our Bible show. Okay, so we have Bible show. Let me just um, put in a random scripture, like let's say Psalm 1, verse 1. Once you put that there, you're going to see it in your OBS when you add your source, NDI source. Let me just put Bible. Okay. Name the source. You're going to see any of your um, NDI. If it's easy worship, is Bible show, anything that's your NDI, you're going to see it over here. So once you do that, you can. Uh, Check the rest if you are not okay with the rest. But once it shows you, okay, yeah, I'm good to go. Then you enter it, and this is your Bible. Yeah. Let me just make it um a studio mode so you can see your Bible and you can see your cam. You can see your cam one. You can see your Bible so you can easily cut it if you want, or you can say you want to transition it and anything. So anything you want here, this is it, your NDI. So you have your NDI for your easy worship, you have your NDI for your Bible show, any NDI at all. It's it's in number that you downloaded the NDI source. You're gonna have your NDI in your OBS and it's gonna be there free of charge. No money to go. Alright, so thank you very much for watching. If this 
uh, video has been very useful to you. Please don't hesitate to like this video so that your algorithm can also suggest it to everyone searching for how to uh, download this NDI plugin because OBS does not come with NBI naturally. All right, thank you very much for watching. Please and please like this video and subscribe to this channel to join this amazing family. Turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever I post new videos, new updates. If you have any questions, you can please um, comment on the section or message me in my um, YouTube, sorry, my WhatsApp, rather, my WhatsApp link is in my YouTube description or you can comment in this video. I'm going to explain and I'm going to answer you as best as I can. Thank you so much for watching. All right, don't forget, my name is Joseph Olaskomi and this is Extensible.